Hi, this is DMAC. Um, today I want to talk about, um, so why play tennis? Out of all the sports you could choose, why would anyone choose tennis over swimming, soccer, baseball, basketball, football, gymnastics, and so forth? Or even over golf? So here's uh, what my thoughts are on why anybody would choose tennis. The reason why I chose tennis is because one, it's an individual sport and at the same time it's a team sport. And the great thing about that is when you play tennis as in team sports, one person who doesn't carry or pull their own weight in the team can lose the competition. Now in tennis, well, like my sister used to tell me, if it is to be, it is up to me. So if you win, you win based on your own merits, or as in doubles, yours and your partner's. And if you lose, you lose because of your lack of merit, or maybe the other player was better. But you have no one else to blame but yourself. And if you give it your best, and of course, you know, you can't, you can't be too upset with that. So that's one reason. Uh, that um, there's such a satisfaction in winning and competing in an individual sport. Um, second of all is tennis is a sport for a lifetime. I mean how many people can actually pick up boxing and play it till the rest of their lives? I mean aside from from golf and maybe shuffleboard or croquet um, there are so many social benefits to playing tennis because you can play it for a lifetime. And the equipment is very simple. Most people can get access to a tennis shoes and socks and, you know, shorts. And the racket is easy and very portable. Now, golf, you have to take the whole bag and it takes several hours. You can play tennis as short as uh, 15 minutes or as long as three and a half hours. So, time is a factor. Uh, thirdly, for health benefits, you know, although uh, although other sports has great health benefits, soccer and so on, you're not going to see too many 45-year-olds or 35-year-olds play in soccer on a daily basis without the wear and tear on your body. Well, tennis, you can do that. You can be as old as 80 and play tennis, and so um, that's that's a wonderful thing. And the atmosphere that you play in. Now with golf you could do the same, but my argument is you got to carry clubs and it's expensive. Tennis you can play at a park and there's not too many municipal parks you could uh, uh, play golf. It costs a minimum of $35. Well once you buy all that equipment it costs you hundreds of dollars. With tennis uh, it may cost you $100 for a good racket and shoes and so forth. Uh, what else? Well, um, there's a great tool in tennis for socializing and meeting people um, and it's a healthy sport it's out in the sun you're breathing fresh air I mean my goodness who doesn't need fresh air in this computer age right so that's another good thing about playing tennis finally um, well it's not really finally but um, when you're a tennis player uh, you tend to think about eating healthy drinking juice orange juice and so forth and there's so many aspects of competition. You can play at a club level, you can play at a tournament level, you can play at an open class level, you can play international, and you know that's one thing I really am grateful for tennis. I was able to travel the world around. And you don't have to be a superstar like Beckham or um, who else? Um, uh, Tiger Woods to play tennis. But with golf, the cost, I think, is a big factor. So um, tennis, you can play almost anywhere. And it only takes a tennis court. And uh, it's, it's really wonderful. Yeah, I've seen so many places because of tennis, and I'm so grateful for that. Uh, I guess, finally, the great thing about tennis is it's a family sport. Golf is not something that can you, you can do s it with a family. And so my recommendation is... Um, Take tennis. Tell your friends about tennis. 
and uh, pick it up at whatever level. And I hope that uh, you will consider tennis. And that's why I love tennis. And there is no other sport but tennis that starts at love. And where is it that where you get zero when you start at zero, you start at love. So there you go. There's the argument for tennis. And those of you that are listening to this podcast, I hope um, you'll listen to my video arguments to that. And thanks for coming to dmactennis.com. Thanks. Bye.